kind of surprised it takes you so long to find your first villager. Uh, it is a little strange, I'll be honest. Bloop unlocked. But I think we might also be, um, like, taking a Ooh. weird path. I found a club and a scroll. Oh, so, nice. I think it's because we're taking a weird path. And Maybe. Well, and also the other problem, too, is, like, it doesn't really, like, point you in the direction of anything. Yeah. It just kind of drops you in and lets you go wherever you want. By the way, we're back, everybody. Uh, and it, wow, okay, you got extra luck. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I already love this game. So, not only did it, like, switch out your weapon, but it also changed your attack style. Yeah. Which see. is kind of awesome. Like, Let's see it, how this works out. Ooh, makes breaking those easier. Much easier. But the uh, only problem I, that you're going to have is you only have, like, maybe one or two hits left. I don't know what that is, but I wanted it. Well, it despawns, so. Ow. Oh, Ow. no. Come here. Bat, why? I don't know what happens when I die. Oh, no. we're about to find out, everyone. You have game over. Oh. Oh. Wow. Wow, indeed. Wow, that's brutal. That is what? extremely brutal. Really? Like, that's like, I'll be honest, Whew. that's kind of like detracting from the game. Yeah. Wow, really? Like, straight up game also, over. Also, like, look at, the, look at the, menu, the map menu. This is straight up, uh... Super Metroid. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's definitely... It's very much a Metroidvania. Like... And again, as we kind of called out... Oh! That's why they call it Metroidvania. Because it's like Metroid and Castlevania as a solid game. Please tell me that this is literally not the first time that's dawning on you. No, this is totally a bit. Okay, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> hey! hey! He was so... Why is it a kobold? Narnia! <laughs> Thanks for helping me get out of the cage, my child. I am Narnia. I run the magic shop in town. I was tending to my horse, Buttercup. But I, I hope she is okay. She gets awfully lonely when I'm gone. She's also the queen of filth. She had lo Bear. true love in her hands and she throws it away. Dumb, stupid bitch. Damn. Boo! Boo! Boobs! Babs! Nah, I, I want to see your boobs. Let me see them babs. All right, let's go back and save again. Hello, and welcome back. All right, we should go. Let's go. I'm gonna Look go back at my to town. beautiful room. Why there's a fucking tree growing inside a dungeon near me is a question for the ages. By the way, do you have a moment to stay a while? Stay a while. Yes. Why is Sean Connery here? Stay a while. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Can we please? Diablo the live action movie? Can we please have a Diablo movie with Sean Connery playing oh. Decker Kane? And, and even if it wasn't like an actual movie, if it was like an animated movie, but you had Sean Connery as fucking Decker Kane. Dude, oh. do, you, do you remember when they made that like really badass um, oh, the, the, Diablo the, anime like short film? Yeah, like the, uh, the one that was like to the tone of the Castlevania one that's on Netflix. Yeah. That one was so badass. How freaking cool was that? Stay a while and listen. Stay a while. Get your ass beat. Stay a while. Cause I'm swole decking, bitch. You don't wanna fuck with me. Oh man, I would. I would love it. Steve, uh, you work for Blizzard. Do I? Get on that. Do I then? I don't know. But you should get on that nonetheless. Right. Uh, I will. Like, Ow! Like, contact Blizz and be like, hey, Blizz. Hey, look, uh, Mr. Morheim. Uh, Mr. Morheim, I am Sean Connery, <laughs> and I would like to be in uh, one of your video games. Your video games? My uh, my friends over at uh, this shitty little YouTube channel 
Tell me I'd make a great deck of cane. So I both simultaneously love and hate Metroidvanias. Uh-huh. Oh, uh, obviously, it's a I found paper. Game. My search for King... Oh, wait, no, this is Professor Bastin. Bastin. Oh, my God. Uh, there's a... There's a... I'm Professor Bastin. I'm Professor Bastin. My search for King Trail may have been in vain, but luckily, I've discovered... Evidence wicked of, evidence. Wicked evidence of a wicked ancient civilization which thrived in these mountains at least a thousand years ago. It's real wicked. I, re I shall refer to them as the Landori tribe in reference to the Landorian mountains. I'm real wicked clever. I'm real fucking clever. In which they once lived. Based on these paintings, they appear to have six fucking pages of this shit. A written language oh. is primitive. Alright, cool. Let's go. That, that was some um, uh, wicked fucking that long wicked. writing. It was wicked boring. It's wicked boring. I don't know why I became a professor. <laughs> I'm a wicked boring person. Uh, anybody from Boston, I'm sorry for mocking you, but uh, I'm I'm just a jerk. That's true. Um, oh, that's right. I forgot you guys existed. Uh, we're goblins. Ah! Yeah. We're, we're trolls. We're trolls. I'm sorry. I forget. Zandula forever. Sandala forever. Oh my god. So in the new expansion, <laughs> the minute I saw Zandala forever, I started yelling it <laughs> in Discord with a friend of mine. Uh, because, uh, like, and and he's just like, you need to stop that. <laughs> and I was like, but, but, but Zandala forever. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever, man. Come on, bro. Did you ever see that, uh, there's a wonderful short. Next time we take a break, I'll show it to you. Uh-huh. Um, uh-huh. Ooh. I don't know what I just did. I think you drank something. Uh, let's buy. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, now you have money to, to uh, you don't have nearly enough money. Magic Molotov. Magic Shuriken. Magic Boomerang. Cool. Warp school, the... learning school, ba -ba -dee -ba -dow. I was hoping you'd teach me magic. Ah, hello, young one. My magic shop is now open again thanks to you. I don't know why Buttercup didn't sell you magic. I've enchanted her to be able to talk. <clears throat> Buttercup, why aren't you talking to people? B Buttercup? Cool. Wait, but. Wait, I'm Bye. so alone. You're boring. Okay. Bye. Papyrus. Papyrus. All right, let's go this way. Maybe. maybe. Aha. No papyrus. <laughs> Aha. Papyrus wins again. Would you like some spaghetti? That's the sound of spaghetti hitting you in the face, by the way. Oh, man. Spaghetti <laughs> whip. Just pasta everywhere. Let's see. Oh. this way. Let's go this way. Spaghetti whip. Uh, you know what you need to do. Sadly, it's not faster. Not that you. Oh, God, are you okay, Tom? That, uh, mm. that sounded like that. That sounded chunky. I might have thrown up a little bit in my mouth. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Oh. Delicious. That uh, that Indian food getting you too. Oh uh, yeah. Mm. Want the magic boomerang? Would you like the magic boomerang? I want the magic boomerang. Magic boomerang is good for you. Bad you for your enemies. Bad for your enemies. Good for you. Cause it's a boomerang. My uncle. Ow. God. Um, I don't even know what to call my uncle in this one. In this bit. Think you're ruining the bit, Tom. Uh, my, oh, my uncle, he had a boomerang, and it wasn't so magic. And he went into a dungeon and he fought some trolls, and the trolls ate him. <laughs> but his boomerang returned, came all the way back home, and let us know what happened. Seems like that boomerang was actually magical indeed. Just didn't like my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing so hard at that. That was real stupid. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Just something about it. <laughs> 
You got me right in the. You got me in the right spot. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. I feel proud Achievement of myself. Achievement unlocked. Warrior. No assets. No ass assins. Ass ass in. I don't know why an assassin is spelled ass ass in. Because you, you you can't like, kill someone without double ass. Like, uh, was the first assassin just real thick? It had some real good assets. I'm real thick. Girl, you thick like a milkshake. Have you seen that gif? Uh, of the prisoner who's like, girl, you thick as a milkshake. Uh, wasn't it a bowl of oatmeal? Was it a bowl of oatmeal? I think it's a bowl of oatmeal. I think he says, girl, you as thick as a bowl of oatmeal. I don't know. I thought it was thick as a milkshake. Uh, you thick as a... Oh, you are right. Girl, you're thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. Good lord. I want that club back. That club was kind of nice. Well, the, the the advantage of the club is it had a, like an arc swing to it. It had an arc swing, and it was also seven points more damage. Yeah, I mean, it also did a f f ton of damage. Yeah, man, damage. And it easily did, like, you know... Uh, All right, just gonna swing fast on him. Like, 60% more damage. Quick maths there, Tom. Quick maths. Quick one maths. One plus one is two. Two plus two is four. But quick maths. maths. Oh man, those little like wiggly worms are really well animated. What? Leveled up at one point? Yes, you just leveled up right now. Dick. Every time you kill something, if you look underneath your blue bar, yeah, I know. You'll see your. Yeah, I see it. It's just weird because usually it, it actually pops up and says leveled up. Well, it also that like it flashes didn't. because you were jumping. I think it was because you were jumping when it happened. I see something. What do you want to see? Okay. Yes. You're gonna eat an apple and regenerate some health. I can't. You could go to the left first. All I right. wonder if there's a save. No. Oh. You but you got topaz. yourself a topaz. Thank you, Mom. Wait. If you go to the left, there's stuff. But if you go to the right, there's dead people. Oh. I do not understand what you mean. What do you mean? Do you know the way? Do you know the way? Oh man, I am shocked that in uh, leveling in the new Zandalari expansion, yeah. that there has not been a do you know the way guy. Because I know that, like, for whatever reason, the WoW devs love memes. Do you know the way? They love sticking memes inside of the game. Do you know the way to Zandalar forever? Do you know the way to Zandalar forever? I got a Forever Zanara. Oh, let's see if you get uh, luck again. Do you get luck? Khan. Uh, Khan, yeah. More. Khan! Why do you uh, why do you put it in the main weapon slot? When I think you, you could I think you have to. Really? Yeah, because I actually went and tried to um, equip the sword to this hand and I can't. Oh, so I'm guessing oh, that's like a shield hand. Or like a ranged weapon hand. I can imagine shield and ranged. That that makes a lot of sense. I just want something for these blue balls. I just want you to find another save point this far in. That'd be great, wouldn't it? It would be. Oh my goodness. Look at all the this is like goblin or like cobalt engineering going on yeah. in the background. If we put box in way, it hold box up! So Box like, support itself, it support wall, yes? Oof. Okay. Okay, well the interesting thing though is is that you actually stun that guy now. When you smack it with your weapon. Yeah. You but I don't him. swing fast enough to to I'm just a little damage light of actually killing him in, in a single swing. Yes, but you could in theory uh swing and then slide back. Yeah. I mean can you? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. So yeah, that, that makes that a lot easier. Unlike with the sword, which didn't even phase him. Yeah, but the sword I can swing twice in a row. That's true. Yeah, with enough, in enough time to actually kill him. Yeah, come on.
Come on, save point. There's a cavern. Uh, I, no, wait, let's, go, let's go to the other yeah, one. Because I peak. feel like there's a boss hiding in there. Maybe. It's just like... <laughs> I'm right. an orange box, not a red box. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. You cannot rent DVDs from me. What's that? But you can play Portal Half-Life 2, Episode 2, and Episode 1. With Team Fortress 2 in here. You're in the orange box. Duh. I don't know. It kind of looks like a portal. Whoa. There's like a mining did, pick thing there. Did the eyes open up on that? I don't think so. Those like orange things. No, I think it was always like that. Okay, I guess I just didn't know oh, that. Oh, hey! It's a fast travel point. We got us a fast travel point. Okay. Which makes sense, because they had those in, um, beep, 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 beep. like, everything else. Yeah. Well, except for the fast travel points in um, Metroid, or Castlevania, was Castlevania, you had a teleporter. Yeah, and they teleported Metroid, to each other. Metroid, you didn't have one at all. You had to run everywhere. Ooh, have enough for... <gasps> Ooh, a silver ring or a magic kniff. What's the magic kniff do? Uh, it does nothing. It does not increase anything. But your magic, uh, the... Mm. The silver ring will do something for you. What is X on this? Uh, beep, oh, there oh, we go. Oh, beep. Okay. A spell for magic throwing knives. Oh! oh! Oh, yeah, see, it goes in circle. Oh! But it's weaker than my fist. But it's a ranged attack. Yes. On a door and so okay, so it increases your. It, I would say the magic knife. Yeah, let's get the let's get the knife. Yeah, get the kniff. All right, uh, you got the kniff. Later, lady. Oh yeah. How much does it cost to cast Two. that? Oh, Three. not bad. Go drink the water. Unless that does it. Nope. It does not. Interesting. Huh? I think that does health and that does mana. Yeah. Yeah. All, All right. right. Cool. We're learning. We got to that point now where we actually have things to do. I like that a simple club is better than the freaking sword I had from the knight. Well, it, it has more uh, weight to it. Sure. So you can swing it harder, while the sword is a, is a skill-based weapon, in my opinion. Like, a sword, you can parry, block, stab, slash, cut, uh, and do a lot of things with. A club, you can parry, block, and smash. I like that you're trying to justify it, Tom. I'm sorry, dude. It's been a long week. Okay, uh, last story before we close this episode out, because we actually are way over time. Uh, oh, oh, no! <laughs> Whoa! Uh, dagger? Okay, nice. Um, I went out to lunch with a, with a co-worker on Friday, and when we were there, uh, one of our other co-workers showed up, and I turned and I looked at the co-worker, and for whatever reason, I thought he was like... A friend I knew in high school. Somebody you used to know. Yeah, somebody I used to know. Somebody and that I, used to know. I uh I looked at him and I was like, oh hey oh. man, what are you doing here? Bastin! Thank you. Uh, fucking Bastin. Bastin. Bastin, there we go. There's a voice. Thank you for your assistance. I'm Professor Bastin of the Gutian Academy of Science. I first arrived in Carthus nearly a year ago. Fucking king of trails, caravan. Look for that shit. While staying in town, I learned of ancient paintings throughout these caverns. To my astonishment, they were made by an undiscovered tribe lived here. An undiscovered tribe lived here nearly a thousand years ago. And then in the Ladari, after these mountains, I began to devote all my time to researching them. They're very interesting people, but their sudden disappearance is what captured my curiosity. Bastin. My work was going swimmingly until something sneaked up on me and knocked me out, Bastin. I believe we were we have a common interest in finding out why these why people, both ancient and modern, keep distant down here. The miners were last blasting on the bottom floor. So we began our investigation there. Bastard. Bastard. Come now. We gotta get out of here. It's wicked scary. Wicked. Uh, anyways. 
So my coworker showed up at work at the, the restaurant we were at, and I was like, "Hey, man, what are you doing here?" And he looks at me and he goes, "Getting a lunch." And I was like, "Oh, cool." So, uh, what are you doing down in this area? And he's like, uh, we work at the same place. And I was like, I knew that. For whatever reason, I thought that he worked with me. Like, my, my friend from high school. And I was like, oh, of course. And I was like, so how did you get down here? And he's like, work is like a few blocks away. And I was like, I'm sorry, dude. And I said his name at that point because I figured it out. It's like, I don't know why I'm asking you these stupid questions. Jesus, Tom. And he looks at me and goes, it's okay, don't worry about it. I was like, thank you. <laughs> thank you for being so nice about it. Because wow, was I ever being stupid. Anyways, everybody. In the next episode, we will have more... Bad Axis and the Adventures of Chad. The Avengers of Chad. Bye. Bye.